to do. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Check me out. I post a new video every day at 9. But boys, you already know what's going on. We're watching a match of you, all right? All right, today, somebody sent me a video through Instagram. Well, I guess I, I guess Instagram wasn't working or isn't working for anyone. Like, it's not working for me and yet neither is Facebook right now. At least I downloaded this video before this happened. So today, we're watching a video of somebody from uh, that's wearing a knee pad and he's got, it looks like ASIC shoes on. Okay, and he's wearing the short shorts. All right, look, 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 look. First things first, first things first. My boy, he's got a little bit of a setup. It looks like he pops the arm up just a little bit when he shoots for that knee. Okay, maybe not the prettiest shot, whatever. He can work on a shot, he can work on a speed, but he had a setup and he shot, all right? He shot how he was comfortable, he was confident, and he got his arm behind the knee. All right, why didn't he take him down immediately? Okay, this, like the hardest part about a takedown is getting behind the knee. That is three quarters of the whole takedown. All right, now watch his knees. Watch his knees when he gets his arm behind the knee. Okay, look, he gets his arm behind the knee and then his knees just stay on the mat. If they stay on the mat like he just got taken on a date. Do not do this, all right? The second your hand gets contact, with your opponent's legs, your feet gotta be on the mat and you gotta be running. Those are the, that is the engine, that is the engine, the transmission, and the tires to your car, all right? You need to be driving, either drive straight forward if you're gonna pick him up and like flare the legs, or if you're gonna spin and run in a circle, all right? There's obviously other ways you can finish, but like in general, bro, just put your feet on the mat and do one. Like you just pick one and if it doesn't work, go to the other one. If it doesn't work, go to the other one. You know what I mean? Whichever one you can think of fastest really is the best option. Whichever one you're most comfortable doing in that moment. It like, you don't even have to think about it. You just do it. You just believe with all your heart that like, all right, this is like, you know what I mean? This is going to work. Like, like, you just have to believe with your whole heart. Very difficult to have that sort of confidence in yourself. But look, all right. So, and then he gets a hold of the leg he gets like a single leg and he lets him pull him so he's still got his knees on the mat all right this guy's trying to run away and he's actually pulling him with him he like when you have a when you have control of a leg you should be driving into your opponent circling trying to push him around the mat okay like he should be running running into him not trying to pull him in you're trying to you're like you're, you're trying to pull him in you shouldn't be like like you shouldn't be trying to pull him in unless like, even, even if you're at the edge of the mat, you should be like, he's trying to run away from you and you're trying to pull him in. You should be trying to drive him over his leg. Like really, like you could probably push him onto his butt from there. Like, like you have control of the leg, you could run the pipe just from right there. But like look at you, like, like you're just trying to, you're just trying to like hug his legs and like sink down. Like that's so lazy. You need to, you need to put your feet on the mat. Put your feet on the mat and run into him. And then look, you like, like, if you would have, uh, like, all right, in this position, this is where high hips win, right? You're supposed to be driving into him with your feet on the mat and your hips higher than his. Look, his hips get higher than yours, and he grabs your ankle. Like, his hips just get, they just get parallel with yours, and he grabs your ankle, okay? If you had high hips and you were driving into him, this would have never happened. This would have never happened, I promise. Okay, but now he's got your ankle off the mat and you're screwed. This is really shit position to be in. This is really, really shit position to be in. Okay, so you're on top of him and he's still grabbing your ankle. Okay, and then he gets high hips. You see what happens when he gets high hips? He pushes you onto your butt. All right, and then he gets in between your legs. And look, look, he can, he switches control. All right, he switches control. And then he, he wraps around your body and he gets his two. All right, and he, boy. All right, so let's replay that. Let's replay the whole thing. All right, so it starts off. Starts off. My boy's got a nice little setup. He gets behind the ankle. All right, he gets real lazy off the shot. All right, he gets behind the ankle three quarters of the way there, and he decides to just sit there and hope that he gets taken down with, like, you know what I mean? Because he's a nice guy. All right, that's not happening. My boy's athletic. He's running. He's trying to run away. This guy's trying to. Ideally, he would have limp legged out. He would have just limp legged out in his position. But in your position, 
he's running away, right? He's giving you his leg. He's giving you full control of his leg. You should have pushed him the way his leg isn't, all right? So you got his leg. Let's say, all right, fuck. I wish my, I wish my girlfriend was here some shit. All right, so you got his leg. His other leg is over here. You want to push him this way, all right? You want to push him this way. If his leg is, is behind me, right? Right, I'm in between, right? I'm holding on the inside of his leg like this. His other leg and, you know, his butt is right here. His butt is right here and his leg is right here. I'm holding on to this leg, all right? I want to push him that way. I want to drive him that way, okay? You know what I mean? Where his leg isn't. Think where his leg isn't. But no, you just let him pull you like you're a freaking, like, like, I don't even know. Like, like you let him pull you like a fish on a string. Like, 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 like you, you don't want to do that, okay? All right, so you're getting yanked around. You're getting yanked around. It looks like like you. The only time you drive is when he's you're losing grip. You understand you want control, but you don't understand how to like, you, like like you get control and then you get comfortable there and you, like you're not supposed to stay there. You're supposed to work up the body. You're supposed to work like like you're supposed to dominate his entire body. Wrestling is the art of dominating another person's entire body, not just one leg. All right, so you don't get con you don't get like comfortable when you feel you're deep on a shot that's that will be your detriment okay whatever he's pulling you around the mat he's pulling you around the mat he gets high hips and he picks up your ankle okay after that he pulls you he like he stands up right by standing up that means he gets higher hips okay it looks like you grab his ankle and he falls all right regardless whether you got your two or not if you didn't let him get control of that ankle okay and then he gets high hips all right he gets Control of the leg and then he gets high hips. All right. That means he's controlling your right leg and his he's controlling your hips with his hips All right, and then he dumps you forward and gets in between your legs. He switches the grip on his arm All right, and then he wraps around your body. Okay, and then that, that exposes your back makes you belly out Okay, and then he gets his two and you're flattened out. Okay, you lost the exchange So obviously in hindsight, it's easy for me to sit on a couch and say like what you did wrong but like these are like you guys take this like think of this think of this while you're wrestling be like okay don't be lazy finish the shot drive like even if it's blind driving it's better it's better to be active than lazy all right if you guys like that video hit the like button hit the subscribe button check out my channel i post a new video every day i post a new video every day at 9.